My name is Isabel Abbott. I am from this area in Virginia, Central Virginia, and I studied art at the University of Virginia. I went to graduate school at the University of North Carolina at Greensboro and finished up there and was able to come back to Charlottesville to teach at the university again. So kind of came full circle, came back home, which is great because now I live half a mile from where I grew up and I'm able to paint in the landscape that originally inspired me to paint in the first place. I usually just draw on site and sort of glean ideas, take just visual notes, and I'll do some photographs for reference as well. And then I work in the studio primarily. I start with a lot of very thin layers and then slowly add in more specific marks and detail. I'm really excited about this new body of work. I really wanted to kind of push things and try something new. And I realized, you know, I've gotten very comfortable with a strong horizon line, a far off view, sort of the space of rolling across the landscape up to that. So I thought, let's take the horizon line away for a little bit. So I started doing some sketches, just literally looking at the ground um, where there was interesting vegetation, interesting light falling, and that you know took, took the horizon line out of the composition. So this body of work is a mix of some of the more classic landscape views that are a little grander, a little vaster, balanced with some that are the more intimate, close up, and by nature more abstract because you kind of, you do lose that recognizable relationship of sky and ground. I use some colors that aren't my most familiar, so that was fun, some, some sort of ochres, browns, pinks that are new and feel specific to the time of year as winter's sort of ending, maybe there's a touch of spring. There's two in particular that come to mind that are squares that are inspired by the ground and the loss of horizon uh, that have a lot of energy and a lot of fun different colors that were challenging and exciting to see come together. If I can capture the joy that I feel when I'm out looking at something beautiful, a very particular day and moment in the landscape and create something out of that that then somebody else can take and love and enjoy. That's, that's my goal.